Hello there guys and welcome to this P3D video. We are currently situated at Nuremberg Airport in Germany and today we're going to be flying the Aerosoft A320 Professional Edition which was recently released by Aerosoft. Also in this video we are using GSX Level 2 by FS Dream Team and we're going to be flying to Vienna. Our approximate flight time today is 1 hour and 5 minutes and we're going to be cruising at 29,000 feet. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to load the fuel into the aircraft uh, using the load sheet and once that's done we're going to summon the ground services to load our passengers. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to turn on the batteries and uh, external power and we're going to go ahead and set the adheres to nav mode. Now go ahead, go ahead and turn on the fuel pumps. And now what we can do is we can shift and four and let's see here, load fuel, load the sheet and we're going to say instant load. All right, so that's done. And now what we can do, why does the parking brake keeps releasing? All right, so let's go ahead now and call the uh, GSX here and we're gonna say request boarding. Ah, Lufthansa is fine. Okay, we're gonna take a look at the outside in a minute here. Um, and the first thing that's gonna happen with GSX uh, level two is that um, the first officer uh, the captain, the first officer, and the, uh, the the cabin crew will board the plane, which is kind of nice for those of you who you know who like this kind of thing. Uh, I think it wants us to open the doors, so let's go ahead and do that. Aircraft doors, and we're just going to go ahead and open all the doors. There we go. Okay. As you can see, the uh, the captain and the first officer are now boarding the plane, and once they do that, uh, you will start seeing the uh, cabin crew um, as well um, exiting the bus and, and boarding the aircraft. Uh, we can see the cargo and luggage trucks are on their way to the aircraft. Right, so just give it a second here, and then we'll start seeing the uh, cabin crew. Uh, coming out of the bus. Cabin crew is now um, heading towards the aircraft. What I'm going to do at this point, we're going to go ahead and set up the McDo. And once we're done with the McDo, uh, perhaps we can come back and take a look at our uh, passengers boarding the plane. All right, so we need some lights here. All right, that's good enough. And the same thing here. There we go. And down here as well. All right, so let me head over here to the McDo, and we're going to go ahead and set up our uh, flight plan and performance data. That's already done. Um, initialization. We are currently at Nuremberg, which is Echo Delta Delta November, and we're going to be heading to Austria. Lima Oscar Whiskey Whiskey. Stick that here. Flight number today is 32905. The cost index is 27. Cruise altitude is 29,000 feet. And IRS, align IRS. There we go. Uh, let's see here. Iris alignment in one minute. Okay. We're going to head back here and we're going to go to the fuel. Um, we've already loaded the fuel or not sure. Okay, so let's return here. Go to fuel, load the sheet. We did load the fuel. All right, so uh, I think we have uh, 
We're going to put the zero fuel here, and uh, the block fuel is 10.8. Right, initial fuel prediction, everything is set here, and now we can hand over to our flight plan, and Echo Delta Delta, looks like the passengers are now boarding the plane. Let's take a quick look at our flight plan here, uh, departing runway 28 through the Rody 3 Kilo departure, runway 28, uh, Rody 3, that would be Rody 3, and insert. And then from Rody 3, or from Rodis, uh, we're going to take Uniform um, Lima 604 to Lampsy. So Uniform Lima 604 to Lampsy. And then we're going to fly direct to Venom. Morning. Thank you. Morning. 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 Let's see here, through, through the Venny 2 Whiskey star, and we're going to say insert. Let's uh, go ahead and check our flight plan. That's top of climb, top of descent, that's Venom. And looks like there is one disco here. So let's go ahead and clear it. Insert. And now our flight plan looks good. All right, all right, let's go ahead and enter our performance data. Uh, flaps 1, trim Hello. is 0 0.06 up. Hello. Stick that there. That gives us a V1 of 136, V rotate of 140, and V2 of 141. Flex temperature is set to 53 degrees, and we are now ready. Everything looks good Hello. here. So, what we're going to do is set this to uh, FMCG. Performance, and that's the takeoff data. Runway 28. All looks good. Turn checklist here. Checklist is on. Copilot is on. And what we can do now is uh, press number one. Cockpit preparation checklist. Good evening, engine master. Both off. Weather radar. Power supply. Wind shear. As required. Landing gear lever. Checked. Batteries. Both on. Electrical power. External power is on. APU fire test. Checked. All our passengers are now aboard, and uh, we have summoned the pushback truck. And we're just going to wait for um, instructions from uh, the Hello, Captain. We're ready ground for services. Locking gear. Brakes. All right, so let's go ahead and release the parking brake. Parking brakes released. All engines clear. Start at will. All right, so we have clearance now to start our engines. We're going to go ahead and start with the engine number two. Starting engine two. Direct one forty three by three. Push your discretion. Engine 2 is stabilized. All right, engine 2 is stabilized. We're going to go ahead and start the engine number 1. Starting number 1. After start checklist. Engine mode selector. Set. APU bleed. Set off. APU master. Set off. Ground spoilers. Set. Alright, let's go ahead and do the flight control check. Full left. 
Checked. Hand signal. Received. Checklist complete. All right, so the checklist is complete. We're going to go ahead and release the parking brake and initiate taxing at 10 knots. Taxing checklist. Exterior lights. Check. Brake check. Pedal press. Check zero. Checked. Auto brakes. Max. Take off data. Reviewed. FCU. Checked. Flight instruments. Checked. Checked. Weather radar. Power supply. Wind shear. Checked and set. TO config. Set. Checklist complete. All right, so the uh, taxi uh, checklist is complete, and the only checklist remaining now is the uh, before takeoff checklist. Uh, we're going to taxi to runway 28 now, and everything is looking good. I really like this airport by Flight Beam Studios. Uh, they were known for creating very high fidelity uh, scenery for uh, P3D. Uh, I sure do hope that they would uh, consider uh, creating scenery for uh, X-111. Uh, really nice clutter, nice ground uh, vehicles uh, in, at the airport. Uh, a very well made in terms of uh, uh, FPS. Uh, it's optimized for performance. Uh, again, really very well made. The weather conditions aren't exactly great uh, today. Uh, as you can see, we have some uh, low visibility here. Um, but it shouldn't be too serious for our departure out of uh, Nuremberg. Alright, at this point, let's go ahead and call for the before takeoff checklist. Flight attendants, seats for takeoff. Before takeoff checklist. Brake temperature. Checked. Brake fan. Off. Engine mode selector. Check normal. TCAS. TARA tilt above. Exterior lights. Set on. Sliding tables. Stowed. Stowed. Checklist complete. All right, so the uh, before takeoff checklist is complete. We are cleared for takeoff, uh, runway 28 here at Nuremberg. And uh, we're just going to line up the aircraft with the runway and set takeoff thrust uh, to depart. Visibility isn't exactly great, uh, but again, uh, it should be all right. All right, here we go. Take off, man, flex, and SRS. Check. Thrust set. Uh, ground air, the 100 knots. Checked. V1, rotate. Positive climb. Gear up. Gear up. Navigation. Check. Exterior lights.
we're doing good. And uh, we continue to climb. Gear is up. Lights off. Alright. I'm going to track the flaps now. Well, folks, we continue our city climb to 29,000 feet. We're about 7,000 feet from leveling off. Uh, everything's looking good. Uh, some clouds here in the vicinity. It was a rough takeoff out of Nuremberg, uh, but everything is looking good now. And we should expect our arrival into Vienna on time uh, in about uh, 40 minutes from now. I'm going to let you guys enjoy the flight, and I will see you soon as we level off at our cruise altitude. Enjoy the flight. Welcome back, folks. Uh, we just leveled off at 29,000 feet, which is our cruise altitude for this flight today. We are approximately 112 nautical miles from the top of descent point. Uh, what I'm going to do at this point is I'm going to go ahead and set our um, arrival information. So I'm going to come over. Actually, let's do it over here. Uh, performance, we're going to go to the phase. We need to enter this information, so we're just going to go to our flight plan here. And we're going to go to the destination. That's not it. There we go. So that's the destination. That's Vienna. Uh, we have zero. We have three knots at zero one zero. Q and H is one zero one six. So one zero one six. And we'll stick that there. Oops. Okay. One zero one six. There we go. And the temperature at Vienna is, uh, let's see here, 17 degrees. Three knots at 10 degrees. So zero one zero at zero three. And the uh, approach speed is 140 knots. We'll stick that there. The decision height is 120 feet. And everything now is looking good. Back to the flight plan, and we are about 98 uh, nautical miles from our destination, from the top of the center point. Um, reference to the giveaway. Um, the giveaway isn't over yet. Uh, I should have probably made the giveaway end uh, on a Thursday or early Friday morning because that's when I normally record the videos. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to announce the winners in the uh, in the widget, and I'm going to post the names um, in the community tab uh, on the channel, uh, and uh, shortly thereafter I will contact the winners uh, with their prizes, and I will probably postpone the next giveaway to next week. So uh, I'm planning on something special for you guys uh, for the next giveaway. So stay tuned for that. Other than that, all is looking good at the moment. And uh, we're going to preset the MCP altitude in about uh, 60 nautical miles or so from now. So until then, please enjoy the flight. And I will see you in a little while. Welcome back guys, uh, we are approximately 22 nautical miles from uh, top of descent and uh, what we're going to do at this point, we're going to take a quick look at our flight plan here uh, to see what restrictions we've got, uh, let's see. So the final platform altitude is 3000 feet, uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to reset the uh, MCP altitude to 3000. And we can just wait now um, until we're ready. Uh, we could actually uh, begin the, uh, the descent preparation checklist. Um, 
Descent preparation checklist. Off. Landing information. Received. Altimeter. Standard. Landing elevation. Checked. Barrow radio. Checked. TCAS. Set. Checklist complete. All right, so we can be initiate the descent at our discretion now. And this is the top of descent mark right here. Uh, if we look here, we are approximately 20, 21 nautical miles from top of descent. So we're ready to go. Uh, what we'll do is, as soon as we reach the top of descent point, we will go ahead and initiate the descent. We are now close enough to the top of descent mark here on the display, so what I'm going to go ahead Captain and do Ewa. is initiate Initiating descent. descent. FMA check. We are passing through uh, 15,000 feet to 3,000 feet, and as you can see, we are going through thick layers of cloud. Uh, I have enabled uh, the wing and engine anti-ice just in case um, to avoid the icy conditions. And all is looking good. Uh, really very nice uh, clouds by Rex Skyforce. As we reach uh, 10,000 feet, uh, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we're oh, experiencing yeah. some uh, pretty heavy turbulence here. Uh, there are some clouds and the weather is less than perfect. Um, hopefully it won't be a problem as we approach uh, the airport. Let's uh, set the barrel reference to Lights on. Barrel reference set and on. cross checked. One, zero, one, six. One, zero, one, six. Set. Check. Looks like some drag is required. Really terrible weather here as we uh, approach Vienna. We are now approaching the Austrian capital, Vienna. So let's go ahead and start the approach checklist. We go. Decal status. Checked. Sliding table. Stowed. Stowed. Heaven signs. Checked. Nav accuracy. Checked. Bearer reference. Right, let's go ahead and engage the approach button. Barrow reference set and cross checked. One zero one six. One and as zero, you can see one, now, we've six. begun uh, decelerating. Checked. Exterior lights. Flight attendants, prepare for landing. 2,500. Gear down. Gear down. Flaps three. Flaps full. Speed check. Flaps full. Landing checklist. Landing gear. Down and locked. Three greens. Ground spoilers. Checked and armed. Auto brakes. Medium. Exterior lights. On. Go around altitude. Checked. Landing memo. Checked. No blue. Checklist complete. 1,000. All right, 1,000 feet to go. Alright, this point, let's... Ooh, we can engage the autopilot here. Alright, so... Autopilot off. 1,000. Let's engage the autopilot there. And it's my plane now. Delta 
Very strong winds uh, here as we come into land. Um, but it should be all right. Not too high. Five hundred. Four hundred. Hundred above. Two hundred. Extremely strong winds. Minimum. One hundred. Continue. Light slow. Seventy. Sixty. Fifty. Light slow. Forty. Thirty. Retard. Twenty. Ten. Five. And touchdown. Welcome to Vienna, ladies and gentlemen. Reversers are out. 70 knots. Alright, we're going to go ahead and uh, exit the runway here. After landing checklist. Exterior lights. Set off. Ground spoilers. Set off. Engine mode selector. Check normal. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and take a quick look at uh, our landing before we taxi into our position. So I'm going to bring the aircraft to a complete stop here, and uh, let's go ahead and take a look at our landing. Alright, our landing is uh, okay, uh, it wasn't too good, it wasn't too bad, it was alright. And here we go, we're gonna be, uh, park the aircraft here at uh, position Foxtrot 01. Aircraft 340, turn left on Kilo right. 3 and uh, uh, stop. Right. So parking brake. The parking brake, there's something wrong with my okay, uh, left take Kilo three and over joystick I think. Yeah, all right, let's kill the engines. And the parking checklist. Parking brake and chocks. Chocks are set, parking brakes released. Engine master. Both off. Cabin signs. Set off. Exterior lights. Set off. Anti ice. Off. Fuel pumps. Two mile final. Cross from a two seven right. Monster tower. Cross two seven right over tower. Set off. ATC. Stand by. Checklist complete. Well, folks, this brings us pretty much to the conclusion of our video today. If you have any questions, please do post them in the comment section below. Until next time, please take care of yourselves and each other. And I will see you all very soon. Thanks for watching and bye-bye for now.